Hey, hey, it's Ash. So today I'm going to be showing you a flip through of Sachin's um, newest book that released this month. Um, if you hear some background noise, my daughter's home. Um, so yeah, and so is my boyfriend. But anywho, um, so I'm going to try and not take too long flipping this book. Um, but let's begin. So here we have a hundred magnificent mandalas. And again, this is by Sach and Sach Deva. Here's the front. Sorry about the glare. And then here's the back. Gives you a couple preview pages. And then we can begin. This book is like pretty thick. So right here, there's eight books total, and then um, it just kind of lets you know how many pages each book has in here. There's the title page, and then you can't really see. Oh, you can see a little bit. I'll shift you over. Um, so we start off with 50 autumn mandalas, and there's 14. So this one I do own, but I own it in like the color by number. The line work um, is nice and like pretty thick, I feel like. So I feel like I shouldn't have a hard time like using my alcohol markers. So that'll be fun. I feel like um, there's like a good mixture too. Like there's some pages that are like kind of detailed, but I feel like for the most part they're not too bad. Um, yeah, <laughs> this is cute. I feel like fall and um, Christmas just like flew by. Um, and then next we have 50 diamond mandalas and there's 12 in here. This one's pretty. This one um, I don't own. So I only own two out of the eight books that are in here. So that's pretty cool. I feel like I'm definitely gonna have a, like a lot of fun using my metallic um, and like my jelly rolls and stuff in this book. This one's pretty. It's like flower. Kind of looks like flowers and diamonds mixed together. definitely gonna have to message Brittany and see if she's gonna end up getting this book so we could do buddy colors this one's pretty cool as well next we have 50 winter mandalas and there's 12 this is the second one I do own that um this book the winter one was gifted to me as a birthday gift last year oh my god I thought he was shushing me. I was like, what the heck? This is cute. Yeah, so like I was saying, I feel like um, fall and winter like flew by and I couldn't like really enjoy it. Like, I feel like I barely even colored in my winter books. This one's cute. The paper, I'm not like a paper expert, but the paper feels different. Um, in this book, but like not in a bad way, like a good way. It feels like a little thicker. It's just cute. <gasps> oh my gosh. So this one's 50 animal mandalas. And I feel like, I don't think I've ever seen a flip through of this book, but I am loving this. Oh my god, this is so exciting. I'm like so excited to color in here. Here's this one. I don't know what kind of animal. Is that like an in? No, I'm not even gonna try and guess. Here's a wolf with the roses. The horse. This is so cute. The zebra. 
the owl, cat, another owl, a turtle, so cute. I think this is a cheetah. I forgot what these are called. <laughs> Um, okay, so now we have 50 Halloween mandalas and there's 12 in here. This one I don't own, but um, I see a lot of people color in this one. And the pages always come out so cute. For some reason, I got a little bit of like, I don't know, I think this was maybe some ink overlapping or something, but that's fine. These are so cute. Next thing you know, Halloween will be here soon with the way the months are like flying by. Here we have 50 steampunk mandalas and there's 12 in here. These are pretty cool. I feel like these will be fun with um, going in with like um, the metallic jelly rolls as well. Like the silver or like some gold. I already have like ideas. I thought these were hearts. <laughs> this one's cool with the clocks. And here we have 50 Christmas mandalas. Wait a minute. How many did I say I owned out of this? One. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, I only owned the 50, the mandala, and the winter one. Yeah. This is the Christmas one. Okay, so here we have 50 Christmas mandalas. There's 14 in here. These are super cute. Sachin's mandalas are definitely very different. I feel like you don't really see um, like this, the way he styles them. I feel like you don't really see them. If that makes sense. Like they're unique. That's the word that I'm looking for. Oh my God, I love this. How cute! This is joy. Oh. I'll definitely be coloring in here come next Christmas. Noel. Sorry, my book is like shifting on its own. Okay, so. Next, we have 50 Celestial Mandalas. This one I had on my wish list. So now I technically have it so I can take it off my wish list. This one's fun with like the moon and the stars and like the planets. This one's cool. Yeah, these are so much fun. I'm excited. Sorry, I'm getting like towards the end and the book just wants to like close on me. I like this one.
Oh, and that was the last page. So here we have, just letting you know um, that you can leave, um, you could give Sachin feedback um, and leave reviews. It definitely helps um, the artists, especially when they're independent. It gets their books out there um, and seen. So definitely do that. It's like a pretty quick process too. So, um, and then down below are just like a few areas that you can reach out to Sachin as well. Um, I'm definitely in the Facebook group. If you're not in there, you should. Um, he does a lot of like polls and asks like what books you'd like to see in the near future. Um, I know the other day he had a poll asking um, if you preferred black background or white for like the paper and stuff like that. I don't really have a preference. Um, um, but yeah, so there's that. And then here is a list of all of Sachin's books. So, um, this is always like my favorite part because in the back he gives you an idea of what book is going to come out next. So let's see. I know it's a little out of frame. So the next one to come out is this one right here is Mandalas and Patterns Volume 1 and it's the 3x3. Three three. I love these 3x3s. Three They're like so much fun. Um, but that's exciting. It says Volume 1 so I, I wonder if we're going to get more in the near future. And then I think that's it, right? Yep. So... On this side, there's just a coloring testing sheet, um, and that's about it. If you, I hope you enjoyed the flip through. I'm definitely gonna leave um, a link down below of this book. Um, definitely, yeah, like let me know if you end up getting this book. I think it's great. Um, I really like these compilation books. I feel like. A lot more artists should do it. It honestly saves on space, especially if you're someone who likes to collect a lot of coloring books. Um, there's like eight books in here, <laughs> so it like saves up space. But um, anywho, I hope you enjoyed, and I shall see you in the next one. Adios.